I should get my cat to review this. That would seem appropriate. Before there was baby cat, there was uh, kitten fur. And kitten fur is uh, the uh, example, the shining example of a true elixir. I don't know why the fuck I have. So one of my subscribers has really been pushing me about getting baby cat and I shout out to you. I love you. Thank you so much um, for turning me on to good. Uh, well, I shouldn't say good. I don't know what this smells like. Thank you for turning me on to new fragrances, new style fragrances, and especially fragrances with the word cat in them. I love cats, unless they claw the shit out of you. This is terrible, this is absolutely terrible. I look like I just got into a fight with a razor blade. Um, so Baby Cat by E. Saint Laurent, YSL. The same people who make, uh, you know, all your favorites. I don't know if this, I don't know what this is. I, I don't know if it's a clone on something. I don't know if it's an original formula. I have no idea. I don't even know if this is, an actual real fragrance. What the hell? There we go. So baby cat, uh, I have never heard of a baby cat. I like baby cats. Here's a picture of my baby cat. Isn't she so cute? Here we go, baby cat. Um, I, I'm getting like a chocolate vibe patchouli like a I think that's the vibe the patchouli chocolate patchouli kind of thing uh, uh definitely like a spice and um so this has like the same kind of thing I find with Roche's mustache eau de parfum uh it, it's got like a patchouli kind of character patchouli kind of vibe to it picking up like a, a resin like a weird dark re resin maybe a sweet nuance in here uh yeah, actually a sweet nuance. Um, it smells like a firework, like a pre-lit firework, like something like 4th of July. Definitely doesn't smell like cats. Almost like a rubbery kind of vibe to it. Like a, almost like a rubber handle, like a rubber handle on a gas station pump. All right, I'm gonna look up some of the notes here on my trusted source for Grantica. Black and pink pepper, black pepper, elamine, pink pepper. There's a lot of pepper in here. Labanum, saffron, bourbon, vanilla, suede, and cedar. Oh, it, it's pretty nice. It's pretty nice. I, I think that the price tag on this thing is absolutely ridiculous. When I was actually looking into like sampling this one, uh, it was so expensive. I was out of, I was like, what? It's such a, you know, like after looking at the note breakdown, it is such a, like, honestly, it smells like a niche or like a niche version of Armani Code Absolute. Like that vanilla, the same kind of vanilla, the same kind of like sweetness, but it smells, it, listen, it smells expensive. I, I don't want to get that kind of confused with this whole review thing. I like, listen, this thing smells of quality. You, you walk into a room with this, like, okay, let's paint the picture here. You walk into this with a suit and tie, like you, that's what you're wearing when you walk into like, to buy a puppy. You're buying a puppy wearing baby cat. Um, and there's like an attractive girl working at, you know, Petco or wherever you're shopping for dogs. Please don't buy from Petco, just adopt. But anyway, so, you know, she's helping you out and you smell like baby cat. Uh, she probably would be sexually attracted to you. That's if you were, you know, nice and caring and understanding of her job. Anyway, uh, regardless, uh, they should get paid more. The, the thing is, this is a very nice fragrance. This is very nice. It's very nice. It's a very sophisticated um, vanilla, sweet kind of vanilla with some woody aspects. And the uh, I, so I'm picking up a lot of like resinous stuff. So like a resinous mixture with the vanilla and then the pepper is kind of just like ever so present. Smooth as hell and it ex it's expensive as hell, literally and figuratively, like this smells expensive. It's pretty damn good. It is pretty damn good. The main aspects you're gonna pick up with it, with Baby Cat, is a lot of vanilla, but it's like a smooth, like, um, it's a smooth, almost like, like a barrel, like a barrel, Vanilla. I don't know what the fuck that means. It just, I think it's a bourbon vanilla they have in there, but it's like, 
a creamy vanilla. And pepper is ever so present and then just a little bit of a resinous kind of vibe to it. It's rich, warm vanilla. It's beautiful. It's really stunning. It has nothing on its flanker, kitten fur. I have no idea why I own this. Um, I picked it up as a joke and uh, joke's on me. Thanks for watching the video. Have you tried Baby Cat? Let me know down in the comments down below. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Right now, it's sitting pretty well with me and I do like it, I have to say.